What is this? What a spam. Oh, it worked! <laughs> no! That's so <laughs> infuriating! <laughs> Sansar and Boomy win Team Temple Storm, but also what? <laughs> This recent series of videos where I analyze the weaknesses and strengths of underplayed or underrated legends has been very entertaining for me to make. So for a third video I ask you, my community, to choose a legend between four options and most of you seem to want to know more about Volkov and why he's not a popular pick. Like always, I like to explore the basic stuff first. Volkov was the seventh scythe legend released back in December 2019, right after Fate, and he holds four points on strength. 8 points on dex, which is quite unusual, 6 points on defense, and 4 points on speed. He's mostly known for having very annoying signatures, especially on scythe, with massive hitboxes and short recovery frames, making him kind of a disliked legend among the lower elo players. The players who have found most success playing Volkov in tournaments are Sandstorm, Pavelski and Wesley, so just like the other videos I went on and asked them what they think of him, and what his main problems are that make him not a very popular pick in pro play. Sandstorm, probably the best Volkov there has ever been, claims he's actually underrated and holds some slipper signatures, also being actually better in 2s than he is in 1s, as Sax is still pretty good, still living after the nerfs, saying he can rob you of your stocks very easily, mostly thanks to Scythe and his insane signatures, though he admits his stats aren't the best and there might be better Scythe legends. Pavelski agrees on the stats comment, saying he has a hard time killing sometimes, but his biggest flaw is his speed, forcing him to use Ensig as a recovery tool very often, which ends up making it quite readable, but other than that he's a really strong legend with amazing six and kind of Overlooked. And for last, Wesley further agrees on his speed being his main issue, since when you try to solve it by putting one point on it, you lose out on strength, and end up with only three points, which is not very viable. It's kinda rare that the legend is barely played due to their speed, and only happens in some extreme cases like Queen Nice, but even then she's played more than him in tournaments between different regions. So could Volkov actually be a very sleeper pick, who a lot of players are kinda scared to try? In my honest opinion, he's definitely underrated, especially in twos, he seems like an incredible option with some team compositions. He has insane team combo potential and one of the best 2v2 weapons, which is X. Scythe might be harder to use, but his 6 make up for the lack of force and multi-target potential, especially side sick and Nensig. Let me know in the comments what your opinion on Volkov is, and if you think he should be played more in pro play. Also, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.